Wow. I think part of the best head. measurement is the two lasers, so yeah. that is over two meters. Yeah, well over two meters. Yeah, that look, that's amazing. I mean, it's almost two meters wide. Yeah. <laughs> that's incredible. I didn't even think these types of corals, these chrysogolian corals, got that big. Surprise! Yeah. <laughs> Always surprised. <laughs> <laughs> and that's why we do this. Overall size. I mean, it looks like the base is 20 centimeters. I mean, like, not the base of the stalk, but the actual mounting to the rock. Easy 20 centimeters. Oh, yeah, it goes down pretty far mm -hmm. below the rock. Yeah, and sort of poking out to the sides as well. Wow. Les believes that this is a very old dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, while we're here, let's do. I mean, the top of it's outside of Herc's light pool. Yeah, it's so big you can't light the whole thing at once. <laughs> Can too. <laughs> Challenge accepted. <laughs> It just keeps getting cooler and cooler the longer I look at it. Yeah, so about two and a half, because I was at 930.8, and now I'm at, oh. Two and a half, wow. Wes uh, also believes over it's, two uh, and a half. Uh, must be thousands of years old because it's so big. Yeah, so we have uh, scientists ashore, also experts ashore. Also, if we can get a zoom on the base as well, that'd be great. If we can get sure, I'll head back down. With the lasers on. Thank you. are giving us their perspective, and they're saying that this this coral that we're looking at right now is probably thousands of years old. Wow. Thousands 